Now, the paramount chief of the Mampong traditional area in the Ashanti region is advocating the creation of the University of Mampong, which would incorporate all tertiary educational institutions in the area. According to Dasebro Sebunsu II, the present dispersed institutions uh, would operate more effectively and efficiently under a centralized University of Mampong. Clinton Yebwa has more in this report. The Mampon traditional area stretches from Jamasi, Ifijasi, and Nigeria to Mampon Central. The traditional area is home to major higher educational institutions, including technical, vocational, and teacher training colleges. Speaking at the centenary celebration of the Mampon Technical College of Education, Dasebre Osei Bonsu said he has sent a petition to the Ministry of Education on his proposal for a unified university. We have Nananum, and together with the Assembly, through the MCE, appeal to the Honorable Minister of Education to join all this congregation of various institutions, educational institutions, scattered within our Mampo traditional area into one University of Mampo. We plead for that and we demand for that. I know the civil civil servants in Accra, what they will return to me is this will cost a lot of money and Ghana government has never trust and whatnot. It is completely wrong. Currently, Ghana government is putting all the bills of the various institutions in Mampong traditional area. Even go down, 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 down to hospitals. All being funded by the same government of Ghana. So I realize that the budget was run out and we can't foot the bill. The Mampon Technical College of Education, MAMTEC, received alumni and affiliates to mark significant milestones in its hundred years of existence. The anniversary was themed the role of technical vocational education and training in the national development agenda. Director General of the Commission for Technical and Vocational Educational Training, Dr. Fred J. Asamwa, lauded MAMTEC's role in providing an industry-ready workforce. I'm reliably informed that Mam Tech is involved in woodwork, metal work, construction, electrical and home economics. Definitely, these are the three areas that we can develop map on, its environment and Ghana as a whole. The nation's economy, Namache, is driven by its active labor force. The utilization of the productive workforce helps in development of the nation as a whole. The Mampon Technical College of Education presently has a staff strength of 127 and a student population of 1,632. The institution, however, lacks an auditorium. As part of the anniversary, the college plans to construct a 3,500 capacity modern auditorium. Principal of Mamtek, Doris Boache Ansa, underscored the agency of the project. Lack of an auditorium for holding official ceremonies. This motivated us to take this as a centenary project. It is my strong belief that our alumni and all stakeholders gathered here today will come to our aid to build a 3,500 capacity auditorium. I am by this reminding our president, now the representative is here, of his promise to the college on the 83rd birthday of Nanamampohine. Reporting for joining is Clinton Yeboah.